A Desert Hot Springs man says because of his neighbors complaining about his barking dogs, they now have to stay inside all night and wear barking collars. KMR6's Angela Monroe joins us with this You Ask, We Investigate story. Angela. The Desert Hot Springs dog owner says it's inhumane. His dogs have to stay inside at night when they need to use the restroom. The dogs were declared a nuisance in June after several neighbors complained about the barking. Lolita and Dutch enjoy their time outside, but once 9 p.m. rolls around, it's back inside for these two. I feel bad. I feel very bad because they're a part of the family. Owner Stephen Bradley was ordered by Animal Services to keep the dogs inside from 9 p.m. to 7 a.m., and they have to wear a barking collar when they're outside. I said, well, if this will solve the problem, you know, I, I'd go along with it. The part that I am unhappy with is, is the curfew hours. I spoke with his neighbor who filed the original complaint. He says he just wants to be able to sleep through the night and that Bradley isn't following the curfew or barking collar rules. Unfortunately, so, some people have nothing else to do but complain about animals. Animal Services told us a night curfew is common if a dog's declared a nuisance. We're really just asking people to keep their dogs inside for what amounts to being 11 hours overnight. Um, most people do that. My dogs go in each night at 9 o'clock and they get let out about 7 a.m. James Huffman with Animal Services says barking dogs are some of the most difficult cases. You have a group of neighbors saying that one person's dog is interfering with their peaceful enjoyment of their property and you've got one person who obviously loves their dogs and doesn't want these restrictions on the animal. But Bradley says these restrictions are unfair to his dogs, causing them to have accidents inside. I'm in agreement with the uh, bark collars, but I would like to, my dogs to have more freedom to go outside when, when they have to, you know, just, just to go to the restroom, you know, that's, it would be the humane thing to do. Animal Services says even if it's past curfew, if they're on a leash, it's probably okay. The ordinance says they're not allowed out beyond that time. If he has the dogs on a leash with a barking dog collar on and the dogs are not causing a, not causing a nuisance, we're probably not going to cite them. When I spoke with Bradley's neighbor on the phone, he told me other neighbors barking dogs are an issue as well. Animal Services says it takes two warnings and then an administrative hearing to declare a dog a nuisance. You can let us know what you think about these type of nuisance dog rules. Sound off on our KMR6 Facebook page.